Hey guys, Pineapple Fisher here with my first video and the kickoff to my FIFA 19 foot RTG channel. Our first video today is going to be the review of Juan Jesus, foot swap player for the month of February. This guy is a need to get card for many reasons. One, City A, that's good connections. Brazilian, that's connections times two. And he's 84 rated. The team that he plays for is Roma, by the way. Along with being Brazilian, can play great football and probably choke you out. This card is as useful as they come. Um, if you're looking to get a very high tier player, center back, whatever it might be, you can trade him in for an SBC. If you actually have a Serie A team and are looking for a new defender, Look no further. This guy is the answer. This guy is the truth. This guy would literally go up there and head some knowledge into your soul and into your mind. Um, the reason I say this, uh, I played a whole weekend league with him and I think five games of division rivals before that. Honestly, the division rivals game scared me. I was iffy, didn't really know how to use him then during the weekend league it all changed and he was by far the best defender of the whole entire tournament for me speaking of foot swap players ea needs to bring back this promotion every single year for foot um in terms of what it gives the players your consumers for for like in terms of what they do to get these prizes phenomenal as a player you want to play the game and get rewarded because you play the game you're putting your time into the game you should get some type of decent prize rewards out of that these foot swap promotions does exactly that exactly that you can either get high rated cards most of the time pretty useful cards they do this strategically for sure pretty useful cards and if not you can trade in these foot swap players for high tier rewards um i believe they have a rare or a jumbo rare players pack they have electron players pack and a couple other ones too but the one that caught my eye was this juan jesus and i do not regret it and if you have the foot swap players needed to trade in to get this reward i highly recommend you do that immediately that way you have time to collect more spc players and trade them in for maybe a batch y batch shui the batman for an spc because he's also 84 belgium and say i think uh la liga so that's a good good league to, to match up with all right let's check out these stats as you can tell, he's low high, six foot one. Weak foot, two stars, skill moves, two stars. I like my center backs with three stars, but that's all right. Pace, phenomenal. One of the fastest center backs in the game, especially for a non expensive inform or team of the year. Uh, defending, above average, could be better. Physical, look at the jumping, 93 jumping. He's already six foot one. His strength is not bad, 86. Aggression, 93. Stamina, also not that bad. Reactions make him good, 81 reactions. I think 77 agility. This guy is GTG good to go at every single level. If we compare him to Chiellini, old goats, definitely gonna get an icon card eventually. Um. Juan Jesus beats him in almost every category, except for shooting and defending. Chiellini is a phenomenal defender. Nothing should be taken away from Chiellini's defending. But in terms of speed and physical, Juan Jesus gets him there. Van Dyke, meta, meta player, body like a tank on a tower. Beats Juan Jesus in almost every category. But if you do quick maths and look into it, he only beats him in defending by one point, dribbling by two, passing by two, and Juan Jesus 
beats Van Dyke in pace and defending. There's three things you gotta look out for, especially in defenders. Pace, physical, defending. Juan Jesus beats him in two out of those three. Van Dyke is also a 100K coin plus player. And you're getting Juan Jesus for the free. Here, you see Boateng, which I haven't seen a lot of, of him in the weekend league or division rivals, but he gets beat out in pace. He gets beat out, in, beat out in physical defense. Juan Jesus only off by one point. The rest, history. It is what it is. This is a free card being compared to some of the best defenders in the league, and, he, and he's beating them at the main positions or the main statistics. Here, Varan. Juan Jesus gets beaten out by two points. Defense, two points. The rest, the rest is Juan Jesus's. Physical, got him. Pace, no. Varane, in this situation, seems to be the better player. Thiago Silva, Thiago Silva, same situation as Van Dyke. Same exact situation. <laughs> has a shot, has a pass, has dribble, has slightly better defense, and that is it. But let's check out some highlights right now. Here, Matuidi's going to make a play down the field. Juan Jesus in position with that 93 jumping. Take a step back. That's height. That's hang time. That's Jordan-esque of this man. The play back down to my defensive side. Versaco with the play. Juan Jesus with a very nice touch. Dribble on the inside. Finds the pass to De Bruyne. Gets the ball out of there. Here, you can see his physicality being used front and center. Knocks down this player, gets the ball back, gets the ball out. Here, seems if he was beaten, comes back and makes a beautiful slide tackle on Griezmann. Some other players, that's a penalty. Maybe most of the time, that was a beautiful tackle. Here, you can see the lovely touch up to the chest, back down to the foot, pass out, and he's starting an attacking play. Dembele on the outside, cuts in. Juan Jesus, I didn't even realize he was there, but he went out of his way to come and make an amazing stop at the right time, get the ball out of there. Here, a lot of times this is a goal. Juan Jesus keeps it in front of him, nice little touch, passes it out. And when you want a player to risk it all, this is what we're talking about. Children on the line, kids, it doesn't matter, he gets the job done. All right. Um, I used him for a whole week in league. Did phenomenal. Um, I'm not going to be training this player anytime soon because I think he's just, he gets the job done as a center back. He's free. He, he, he has everything I need. Um, cons, he's not as consistent as the elite center backs. Like Ramos will make fantastic plays all the time. Um, team of the years, fantastic plays all the time. Icons. Their icons for a reason. But other than that, you want to save coins. You want a very, very good player. You want a very useful player and a player that you can build a team around. This is the player to get. With that being said, that's all for this video. Hopefully, I can make great contact for you guys. Some, uh, I think, f probably this week, maybe next week. We'll see. Um, but have a great weekend and have a great time. Bye.